Hi there, I'm here to share about silicon. What is silicon? Silicon is a chemical element with symbol SI and atomic number 14. It is a hard and brittle crystalline solid with a blue-gray metallic luster, and it is a tetravalent metalloid and semiconductor. It is a member of group 14, carbon group, in the periodic table. Carbon is above it, and germanium, tin, and lead are below it. Who discovered silicon, and how? Credit for discovering silicon is given to Swedish chemist Jones Jakob Berzelius, who reacted potassium fluorosilicate with potassium to produce amorphous silicon, which he named silicium, a name first proposed by Sir Humphrey Davy in 1808. The chemist named silicon is, Scot is a Scottish chemist named Thomas Thompson. He changed silic silicium into silicon with O-N at the end of the word as silicon shows more similarities to boron and carbon than to the metal have I-U-M at the end of word. What is its properties? Its atomic number is 14. It belongs to group 14 and period 3. It is a metalloid. It has 14 electrons, and electrons per shell is 2H4. Its appearance is crystalline, reflective with bluish tinged faces. What is its common application? It uses ingredients of materials. Glassmaking utilizes silicon in its form as sand or silica. Silica is also used to make por porcelain or and other types of cer ceramics and is an ingredient in concrete and Portland cement. It's also used to make fire brick, a type of brick that can withstand high temperatures and so is used to line fireplaces or kilns. Its other common application is to alloy with metals. When silica is alloyed to cast mat iron, it creates a more durable form of steel. It can also be alloyed with aluminium to produce molds for car parts. When small amounts of other elements are added to it, silicon is an effective semiconductor. There are some facts about silicon. First, silicon is the second most abundant element on Earth by Mars, making up over 27% of the crust. Is commonly encountered in silicate minerals, such as quartz and sand, but only rarely occurs as a free element. It's the eighth most abundant element in the universe. Second fact is, silicon is needed for plant and animal life. Some aquatic organisms, such as diatoms, use the element to construct their skeletons. Humans need silicon for healthy skin, hair, nails, and bones, and to synthesize the protein's collagen and elastin. Dietary supplementation with silicon may increase bone density and reduce the risk of osteoporosis. And there are some threats brought by the silicon. It may threaten our health. Miners, stone cutters, and people who live in sandy regions may inhale large quantities of silicon compounds and develop a lung disease called silico silicosis. Exposure to silicon may occur by inhalation, ingestion, skin contact, and eye contact. And that's the end of my sharing with silicon. Thank you. See you next time.